anal fistula also called as fistula in ano is one of the uh, complex problems experienced by a portion of the general population majority of the times anal fistula is a consequence of an infection an abscess that happens because of the anal glands around the back passage when this abscess ruptures it can open to inside the back passage as well as to the outside leading to a, a gutter like abnormality called as a fistula depending upon where the fistula is opening to the inside to the outside they can be categorized into simple fistula in ano or a complex fistula in ano the treatment of fistula in ano is varied depending upon the location of the fistula and where it is connecting in relationship to the anal canal as well as to the outside what is vital and important in the management of fistula in ano is to assess the anatomy of the fistula itself this is undertaken by various investigations which includes an mri of the anal canal endoanal ultrasound and at times we have to subject the patient for an examination under anesthesia based on the anatomy of the fistula various treatments can be suggested people have looked into various treatment modalities for fistulae including injecting glue into the fistula applying a plug into the fistula removing the fistula itself called as fistulectomy or laying open the fistula called as fistulotomy and also use threads called as setons either to prevent recurrent problems from fistula and at times to get the fistula healed up the extent of the muscle which controls the back passage involved in the fistula tract is important because if you lay open too much of the muscle patients will land will land up in problems related to leakage of stools and would lose the control to hold the wind which we call as incontinence to flatus and incontinence to feces it doesn't happen that commonly it can happen in about a third of the patients who have high fistula that are laid open we have to be extremely cautious in female patients who have fistulae anteriorly because the muscle that is present in a female is much shorter and much thinner the complex fistula can also be opening on the inside not into the anal canal but to the rectum higher up and also to the outside these are called as complex high fistulae and when such is the case majority of the times there is less to be done with extensive surgery but we provide symptom control by using threads called as setons at times we do undertake major procedures where we will have to take out the tract and essentially bring down the bowel healthy part of the bowel to the back passage but this involves a big operation so in summary fistulae are a common problem if not dealt with appropriately they can lead to significant problems and impaired quality of life thank you